But have you guys heard the news that Tim Hortons is being sold to Burger King? Good morning, everybody. We are off to a great start this morning. It is only nine o'clock in the morning and we are all dressed and ready to go out for the day. I'm so impressed because that like never happens in our family. It's always like 10, 30, 11, then we run into lunch and yeah. So I'm really excited. So we are going to go back to school shopping for the kids. Um, they need a couple of things. I want to get some comfy pants for Malachi because it's hard for him to like to do up buttons and stuff on jeans and they're not very comfortable to wear all day at school. So I want to get him some comfy pants and Abony um, wants to get some new shoes and she wants to try to get some <laughs> with what? Laces. With laces. And why can you have sneakers with laces? And you know how to do it now, right? We'll do um, a video of that later to show you that she had learned how to tie her shoes in less than 10 minutes. Guys, craziest thing happens. We're walking out of the store and we're walking towards the van and I'm like, that's not our van, is that our van? Because the door's wide open. Like the back door right here, like the sliding door, is wide open. And I'm like, that can't be our van, but that's where we parked, that has to be our van. So I walk closer, I'm like, yeah, that's totally our van. And I'm like, oh my goodness, the door's open. How did the door get open? Mommy. And I remember locking it. And, and we set a B. And what? A B near the door. Yeah, to go in the open door. Yes. We closed it in time. But anyways, um, so I'm like, oh no, like that's the worst thing. I I remember locking it and everything. And I even remember like the car that we parked beside. We um were like making sure that there's no car seat in the back because we were kind of close because it was a squishy parking spot. And um and so I remember like doing that and checking like, oh, they wouldn't hit the door. So I remember the door being closed. So this is so weird for me. Anyways, I'm really grateful because like Nick's wallet was sitting um, right here like this, right out in the open, like so much stuff in here, like our GPS, everything. There's some money there. Like it could have been stolen and like someone could just easily just help themselves to whatever was in our vehicle. So I'm really, really grateful that nothing was taken. Guys, I'm freaking out right now because I don't know where my kids are. I'm like, seriously, like we just came out the doors and now they're gone. So like, they're not here. Where did they go? Where did my kids go? brick wall. Leave it to my boys in the shoe store to get a shoehorn and start having a sword fight. <laughs> you having your sword fight? <laughs> what do you think you're doing, mister? for Tim Hortons for lunch and the whole building, I don't know if you can see it through the window, it's all shut down. They have so much construction around it, but it made it look like the other side of the building was open. So I took the kids all out of the car and I walked around the other side and it's completely closed. They have it all blocked off and there's just this little trailer. I don't know if you can see it over here. See it out the window there, see that little trailer? Yeah, that's all it has. So like there's no sit down restaurant. So now I called Nick really quick and I was like, Nick, we'll meet you at the Tim Hortons by your work. So we're gonna go meet up with him really soon. Hey guys, what's up? So I'm just waiting for Vicky. We're supposed to meet at this Tim Hortons and I don't know where she is. I guess she's just a couple minutes behind, but uh, yeah, I'm on my lunch break and the kids and them are gonna meet me. It's kinda nice, eh? But have you guys heard the news that Tim Hortons is being sold to Burger King? What? Crazy, right? I hope they do because I love Burger King. And I want all the Tim Hortons to be one of those ones where like half is Tim Hortons and then the other half is Burger King. Cause then there'd be like a friggin' Burger King everywhere you go. It'd be amazing. And Whopper Wednesdays would be a whole new ball game for me. So fingers crossed that they do buy them out. I know a lot of Canadians probably right now are like, what is the matter with you? Why would you want our 
Canada company to be sold to America is uh who cares man just give me some friggin whoppers I don't care who owns a company just as long as they're dishing out good prices and good food the kids just pulled up but they don't know I'm here so I'm gonna go over and surprise them from their side see if they see me ah! hey guys Hey, bud, what's up? Oh. Are you tired? Yeah, he was sleeping in the car. Oh, he's sleepy. Yeah. Yay, we're gonna have some family lunch. Yay, Yay. Okay, we're finally on our way home. I can pretty much guarantee that all three, or at least two, not including Abney, will fall asleep on the ride home. Got some sleepers in the car. Not happening. Here's Malachi with his head way over. <laughs> and... There's Levi, fast asleep. Hey guys, what's up? So I'm just gonna go ahead and end the vlog. We're in the middle of a bunch of different projects right now, as you can kind of see. Do, 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 do. So yeah, we're busy, I'm tired. I'm doing some other stuff for my other channel too. It's keeping me up all night. Anyways, if you haven't seen, if you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead and click that subscribe button because we want you part of the community, man. And don't forget to leave some comments below and give us a thumbs up if you like this video. See you guys tomorrow.